हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व सम न्यूमेरिकल्स बेस्ड ऑन गेज फैक्टर आई एम हियर विद द थर्ड न्यूमेरिकल एंड इन दिस न्यूमेरिकल यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट गेज फैक्टर सो लेट अस रीड द प्रॉब्लम द प्रॉब्लम इज लाइक दिस द रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ 125 ओम स्ट्रेन गेज इज चेंज्ड बाय 1 ओम Changed by one ohm when subjected to a strain of four thousand micron. Four thousand micron. Find the gauge factor. This problem is very easy. One liner problem. So let us write the quantity which are already given in the question. Resistance of the strain gauge is given as one twenty five ohm. 125 ohm and change in resistance is 1 ohm change in resistance is 1 ohm so delta r is given delta r is equal to 1 ohm delta r is equal to 1 ohm and a strain of 4000 micron is applied strain means you have epsilon epsilon is equal to 4000 micron means 4000 into 10 to the power minus 6 micron means 10 to the power minus 6 find the gauge factor find the gauge factor here you have to calculate gauge factor so formula we know that already already the formula of gauge factor gauge factor is nothing but delta r by r divided by delta l by l delta r by r divided by delta l by l delta l by l is nothing but delta l by l is nothing but epsilon so uh, you have to calculate here gauge factor no problem delta r delta r is given delta r is equal to 1 divided by r is given as 125 ohm so it is 125 divided by delta l by l is nothing but delta l by l is nothing but this value epsilon delta l by l is 4000 into 10 to the power minus 6 4000 into 10 to the power minus 6 okay now from here gauge factor will be equal to 1 divided by 125 into 4000 into 10 to the power minus 125 into 4000 into 10 to the power minus 6 okay so it will be equal to 1 divided by 125 into this can be written as 4 into 10 to the power minus 3 10 to the power 3 here and 10 to the power minus 6 here it will be 10 to the power minus 3 let's move this 10 to the power minus 3 in the numerator so it will be it will be 10 to the power plus 3 And 10 to the power plus 3 is nothing but 1000 divided by 125 into 4. 125 into 4. 4 and 1000 will be cancelled out, and in value in the numerator will be 250. Right? So 250 divided by 125 it will be equal to. So from here, this factor is. This is your answer. Answer is two. Okay. Thank you.